Okay, here we have FreeNAS 9.10.2 U2. So this is um, an updated version of FreeNAS right before they came out with the FreeNAS Corel or FreeNAS 10. So what I'm doing here is uh, we're just under system update and we're checking for updates. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's got to wait for it and then it's going to say, yeah, no updates available. But now we have the little clicky here. We can go uh, select FreeNAS Corel Nightlies or Stable. You generally want to go Stable. Just hit Confirm here. And uh, basically now we check again and it's going to say, oh yeah, there's an update. And so it tells us we're going to go to the release version of FreeNAS Corel and apply updates. You know, it's going to download them here. Uh, this, especially, uh, I did this on the first day it came out, so this was incredibly slow. As you can see by the rates there, I've sped up this section of video just to, you know, get us through it real quick here. Um, anyways, and then you get to, from the downloading to the install, you reboot the system, and I had a ping going up you couldn't see there, but anyways, I just refreshed the page here. going to log in with the exact same credentials, root or whatever user you're using for root access and the same password you had before and then you just click sign in here and you get this totally different interface and in yeah like literally we're we're updated here um it's still doing some stuff in the background and we just got kicked out so no big deal we're just going to log in again here and um it might show some tasks on the side there saying it's updating but anyways we're in this new version uh, we're going to need to reboot the server to kind of finalize things here. Uh, I know at least currently at the release, um, it it needs another reboot as part of the process. Often you'll get kicked out. Um, anyways, we're looking here just under the volumes. You can see the volumes got imported successfully. Um, they're just as they were. They do need updated though. So you need to update those volumes. They're going to have an option to do that. Um, and, oh, and the big new ad here is Docker. So Docker, uh, you it's just if you've used Unraid, you'll be kind of familiar with this. It's a totally different looking interface, but it's the exact same idea. Uh, you'll notice on the right there's a task migration of FreeNAS 9 to 10 settings going on here. Um, Anyways, there's a wizard. It's just like the wizard before. Uh, updated graphics integration here. Um, so yeah, you got to wait for that migration to finish. During that process, at least how it is today, I'll say that again, it might, they might fix this in the future, it might kick you out when it's pulling in the settings. And if you get kicked out and you can't log back in, you might need to go to the console, like to the actual machine or to the IPMI interface and might have to force a reboot. Uh, shouldn't be an issue. I had to do it. Okay, here we go. We're getting kicked out. We're going to need to try and log in again, and it's going to be a failure. And uh, like I said, all you got to do is go to the console or IPMI console, and you got to reboot the system. That's all. Anyways, I'll have some more videos here uh, coming up about FreeNAS Corral. It's a really exciting new version of FreeNAS that finally brings it up to date with competitors like Unraid and other solutions, uh, storage solutions that let you use things like Docker and virtual machines well integrated. Before FreeNAS did have Jails, so I'm aware of that before anyone shouts that out in the comments, but Jails weren't quite the same as Docker and you know I am not a total expert on that but they are significantly different and docker being a more widely supported uh, platform or service um, I'm not really sure how to define docker it's really interesting it's like application virtualization with little chunks of the OS that you need but anyways this video isn't about explaining that and I hope you come back uh, check out the rest of the videos I'm going to be uploading here in the next week or two as I discover Unraid, I mean, yeah, free NAS Corel. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for checking out the video, guys. Bye.